friends, viewers, lovers, soldiers of the Muffin Army. <laughs> uh, I'm so stupid, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Oh my god, that was a lot. Uh, that was two people. Two people I couldn't kill. No, but guys, seriously, on a real note, I found out some really good news about the next Call of Duty, and I felt like sharing. Oh, I know. I'm so original like every other YouTuber. I know. I know. Oh, gosh darn. You make my skittle want to fiddle the whittle before I shoot my load all over a fiddlestick biddle. So originally, the new Call of Duty was rumored to be located in space for some reason, futuristic in that format, which no one really wanted. I don't want it. I'm like, I was alright with all the Call of Duties that were futuristic, but I feel like it's time to, you know, go back to its original roots and just, you know, go back to actually walking on the ground and not flying like six feet in the air. Let's be honest, that's all we want. We want just a basic Call of Duty. We don't want all this high-tech crazy shit that we can barely comprehend. Most likely, the new Call of Duty will take place in outer space from what the cover of the new Call of Duty looks like. Because recently, there's been a leaked picture of it, and people are just freaking out about it. I'm like, I am too, because on it, on the new Call of Duty, it's confirmed too that this is actually the Call of Duty, supposedly. I, this is what I've been hearing rumored to be that it's true, and I'm hoping it's true, because on the cover, and if you guys want to look it up, just Google search it, you'll probably find like the first thing, or just go on Twitter. You'll see a bunch of pictures on it. It's crazy, because on this picture, on the game itself, it says includes Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So this means, this actually indicates that we're actually going to get Call of Duty 4, I believe, as a remastered, because it says Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered. You know how fucking amazing this is, guys? <laughs> From the bottom of my heart, Infinity War. Oh, you were just looking out for me, man. You you fam now. Oh, God, I love you, bro. We went through a tough time with Call of Duty Ghost, and I was just like, we can't be family anymore. We can't be this. It's not me. It's you. Most time people say, it's me, not you. But no, no, it was you that time. It was you all the way. Because Call of Duty Ghost, what were y'all thinking? What the fuck were you guys thinking? For real, please tell me. I honestly would love to know. I'm waiting. I'm waiting. So from the looks of it though, we're gonna have a futuristic Call of Duty. We're just gonna have the additional feature of having Call of Duty Modern Warfare on it, which is great. I'm happy with that. That's amazing news for me. Like from that, I am filled with excitement and joy right now. The memories that are infested into Call of Duty 4 are just majestic and amazing. Oh my god. And to remaster it, I get to relive that. I get to play on high definition, amazing buttload graphics that are gonna be awesome. It's gonna be great. I'm so excited. Like, I'm actually really hyped on it. I've been saying that a lot in this video. I'm sorry. I just really am. Can you not tell that I'm excited as fuck? If you do look at the cover, though, it shows a guy just like as usual. Every Call of Duty cover always has that one dude just chilling there because, you know, he's just... I'm the chosen one. I'm a badass. Make me the cover of this Call of Duty. It shows that guy holding, like, some type of, like, Bioshock looking, like space helmet or something like that. Something like futuristic out of the ordinary that's not usual. And Infinity War, they even said that they're going to go really creative and use their imagination with this shit. And supposedly there's going to be time traveling, which I'm, I like time travel shit. That shit's the best. There's like a new video game out called like Quantum Break, I think it's called or something like that, where it's about time travel. And that shit, I've been watching a little bit of it just because I'm too cheap to buy it at the moment. But from what it looks like, it looks Oh my god, it just looks amazing. I want to get it so badly. I'm not going to watch all of it and ruin it because I do want to actually do like a let's play on it. But that's going to be down the road. But besides the point, the new Call of Duty is going to be futuristic with maybe some time travel. And it's going to have a remastered version of Call of Duty. That's fucking insane and amazing, guys. You don't know how happy I am. But maybe you guys aren't happy with this and you're just like, No, no, fuck it. It's going to suck. Like all the other ones, which you could be right. For all you know, maybe it's gonna suck, okay? Maybe it'll be like another Call of Duty Ghost. Maybe we'll all just give up and go back to the old cause and never come back to futuristic games again. Who knows? But for me, I'm excited as shit for this. And honestly, if the game does suck, at least, at least, we'll have Call of Duty 4 remastered. I'm perfectly fine with that just being the new Call of Duty of the year. If that was, I would be happy as shit, okay? That would make my day amazing. And I'm curious if they're actually going to remaster all the other Modern Warfares. Because Modern Warfare 2 and Modern Warfare 3, oh my god. The memories in those two, uh, just all of them. It's just the memories that are infested in those games are such 
Oh, it's just such an amazing time in my life when I was playing Call of Duty. It doesn't feel the same anymore when I play it, but on those games when I started playing Call of Duty and getting into them, it, it was just such an amazing feeling that I just can't, it just can't be replaced from now. I don't know, if they remastered all the Modern Warfares into like one collection, that would be amazing. Maybe they're going to do something like that. Maybe additional DLC will be for Modern Warfare 2 or Modern Warfare 3. Who knows? But all I know is, I'm going to end this video, guys. So if you guys want to, make sure to hit a like button if you enjoyed it. If you didn't, please leave some feedback and let me know how I'll make some changes and try and make it better for your liking. But anyway, guys, if you could, leave a comment below. Let me know how you feel about the new Call of Duty. Are you excited? Are you pissed off? Are you emotional about it? Are you just going to start playing Halo and leave the Call of Duty franchise? Most people have. Most people will do that, most likely. Every Call of Duty, just everyone's leaving because our community is really fucked up. But, yeah, so I'll catch you guys later. Have a wonderful day. Peace out, guys.